Hello guys, it's Capacad once again with Last Day on Earth. In this particular video, we're actually going to the settlement. The settlement is near at your home base and it's one of the newest updates they have made on Last Day on Earth. Now, first of all, guys, there's a lot of things you need to do and learn about the new uh, update. This particular update here is actually making it uh, and a new gameplay. I'm just gonna show you guys that I'm not actually going to win this particular point It's this one right here and then we're going to build some of the elements that you actually need in this particular area Now when you actually start up this one, you can see I'm at uh, level 15 right here You're incapable of actually getting daily loots as well And these particular daily loots are used for actually upgrading your character these one right here uh, are the tax are the one that actually upgrade them. I made a video on that and now we're just gonna show you guys how to do this. Now you always need a specialist for carrying these kind of items here and you can see you need to upgrade different kind of uh, people here. I have uh, upgraded Lemmy and it is actually giving me not a chance for doing this particular task here because I'm, I'm doing it because I'm incapable of carrying around with this guy but he's one of the best guys they actually got. So that means that I'm not actually using him for fighting. So when I out of doing it here and you can see he's actually going to carry around these particular items you can see it is recommended that you have 1275 smackers of points in gear points and these particular gear points are actually getting higher every time you level up these characters here so i'm not going to do this one because i'm actually going to die you can see i have 760 when you die you just have a chance for doing it over you actually don't lose any points on that so don't worry about that guys you can do that over and over this one right here are the ones use the tax and then you're going to buy them right here you can also buy them for uh, real money uh, and I actually recommend that you are uh, upgrading as fast as possible. This one right here uh, is uh, using the points here on different kind of levels so you can actually level up your characters so you can see the points right here then you just tap this one and then you have upgrade all of your characters. Now I've gone through all of this before but this one right here is all the items that you actually collect and these particular items here are used for upgrading your home base. You can see inside of my uh, inventory I have these pine beams and these one right iron belts. Now those are actually uh, doable to be made inside of this uh, camp. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. Now, when you're upgrading your home base, you slowly, this new settlement, sorry, uh, you actually get the chance for making different kind of tables. Now this table here is a uh, found driver, it's actually made and this one right here just need to do these uh, progress here. And one of them is building the wall. I don't have the items for that. And that's one of the reasons why I want to do the um, quest that I was showing you guys before we were driving in the car and actually shooting these zombies. Now this one right here are uh, items that I need to make. So we can actually go inside of here and then we tap beside building. There's different kind of, of things here. And even though they're not lighting up, we're actually capable of building some of those items here. So if you're gonna see the storage here, I still have some things that I actually didn't make. Then go back here into the workshop and this one right here I made all the limit things that I need to do right now and the font dryer actually is this one right here we need to build and for doing that we need one more of these particular things here so we're actually gonna find that uh, and I'm actually making those myself like I said before inside of this one this one right here uh, is making these items so this is actually doable for me for actually making this one right now and I'm just going to do one more thing, guys, because I need some bolts. You saw I need bolts. And the crazy thing is, actually, in cable of tabbing, you can see there's a house. There's a, right here, you have, um, in the right corner, you have uh, the minimap. Then you, underneath that, have a house. You can tap that. And then you can fast travel between your uh, two district, if you can say it like that. It's your settlement and your home base. And those two areas, uh, you're in cable of traveling for free energy giving you the chance for actually using the energy for good instead of just using it for traveling behind uh, between your two uh, bases. Now I'm gonna take some of these one right here because I'm actually gonna make some more of these and I use 20 of these for actually making one. And then we need some bolts. We're gonna find some bolt guys. And I'm actually going to take some charcoal as well. There we go, I'm making charcoal. It's been a long time since I'm actually making charcoal because I didn't need it that. Uh, you can see I'm out of wood. I don't know how you can get out of wood. Uh, a simpler reason is because I'm actually not harvesting in those low level areas anymore. But I need to do that as well. So let's just see here. We need some bolts. How and where did I put all my bolts? I, I, some of you guys actually said, Copycat, I think you're the only one that have no particular 
<laughs> I, I, I don't know where my items are. I'm using so much soy finding out where those items are. I can't remember how many bolts were needed. And so, yeah, I'm just traveling around here, running around, sorry, my home base, trying to figure out where all my items are. And don't need 20 of these, so I think this should be more than enough. And it look okay. So let's just travel back. You take, uh, you can see there's uh, two houses now, so that means that you're capable of traveling between these two areas. So we're gonna travel back, fast traveling, to the settlement. So that we can actually do this uh, new uh, items here. So I'm actually looking for for finding out what kind of items that we're capable of building inside of that. And I hope it's some kind of wire or something. Let's see here. Okay, so first of all, we are actually taking this one. Then we are where to put it. We're incapable of putting it inside of here. We're not incapable of putting it outside. These are different kind of uh, areas. So this one right here, this uh, square right here, eight feet square, is actually. Um, Built for building these kind of cargoes here, so we have the pallets and so on. Uh, that's uh, the storage area, and this one right here is actually where I'm, I'm building some of the items, like for example the pine beam. I'm going to do that just in a second as well, so you guys can see that. So you need different kind of uh, squares here for actual making. This one is a six foot square, and it's actually saying what kind of uh, how big it need to be. So that's why I made it ready here for a six feet, one more, and an eight feet right there for a future updates. So let's see, we're gonna build this one. And then we're gonna see what we're actually in Kegel doing here with this one. What is this? We're not in Kegel doing anything? Okay, we we just build it. So that's, that's just the thing we in it. Okay, so by building these this one right here, I have no influence in what's actually to build here. So that make it next time when we're building the wall, we're in capable of getting uh, the drawing bench as well as this grindstone. This looks actually good. I hope the grindstone is going to be actually shoving up some of the, my main weapons. I do hope that we're in capable of doing that. And then we're going to see what else are we going to be in capable of building here. That would be actually pretty nice. I have some new things here. These one right here are Oh, we are incapable of building this. So we need uh, uh, we need to build a, a new square here. And I don't know if it's actually going to be... Uh, so we're going to make a control desk. I'm definitely going to do that right now. So let's just build uh, this little square right here finished. I don't know if we need to, uh, to have uh, how big it's not going to be. So let's just hope that this should be enough. Let's see, guys. Otherwise, we need to tear down wall and actually do that again. Uh, here we go. This one right here. Oh, that's good. So there's six feet for this, actually. So let's just see what actually we need here. So we need a sampling table as well, a box with parts. Oh, okay. And by doing those two things, and again, when we have the wall, it is one of the good things when I'm actually making the wall at level two, I actually level up all of my storage things here, all in this settlement. So let's see here. Uh, what does it cost to make that new thing here? The sampling table, okay. So the sampling table, I still need some iron bolts. So I'm going to build that. And the spring, I do have those, but it is actually pretty hot getting the spring. I don't know why that is. And I, I know why that is, because one of the things in those springs are actually used for upgrading the weapons as well uh, as your motorcycle. And I use a huge amount of them on the motorcycle. I don't know why I did that, but I actually did that. So I got all my bags at my uh, storage at my motorcycle. You guys don't know how to actually get an upgrade on your motorcycle. Please watch the videos on that. I have a tons of videos. I have 250 smackers of videos for you guys for actually waiting for your time to actually see. So just use a month watching all the videos. That would be good. Okay, so let's see here. This one right here. This is a new part, line frame. I don't know how to do that. So this one right here, maybe we, the sampling bench is making the line frame out of the pine beam. That sounds uh, like something it will do. So let's see. We need three more of these... Uh, iron bars there so let's just say it is this one and then we're going to oh my god now i just use this that's so even irritating you need iron guys so iron is this element for actually making those things so let's see if we have some iron here we do have some iron that's a good thing and remember all of these items here all of these items at the storage right here is actually 
it got by just a second and they were actually I got those from um, going to the settlement area here on on this one right here I don't know why I call this settlement this one right here uh, expedition here so when we're doing the expedition we're getting different kind of prizes you can see right here we're getting uh, when we're doing this one we're getting the rubber hose and the next one is getting us uh, screws as well as a sheep or so whatever it's called and all these items here are giving us a chance for getting even more here you can see get some weapons and so on and we're gonna uh, this one right here I think it is it's giving me the last uh, aspirin stone or whatever it's called for actually building uh, the garage that's uh, the next step I need to do so uh, all of you guys that don't know anything about this one this is from uh, the new survival path and I made all the other videos on the survival path until this one right here and yeah I'm looking forward for actually getting higher up in, in the this uh, new um, yeah survival path and I will just do more videos on this particular one so if you guys want to see that please subscribe to my channel and give this video a like I'm Capicat I'm actually just gonna make some more of these uh, iron here belts as well as this one for you guys so you can see how to do that just need to put that inside there and then you're making the beams and this one right here is for the this one right here so now we're making a couple of this as well hope you guys enjoyed this see you guys next time bye bye guys and as always guys have fun playing it this is last on earth bye guys